Hello everyone. My name is Habiba Ahmed, a scientist in Genius Academy, and this is my scientist friend Aisha Muhammad Ali, also from Genius Academy. Today we are going to explain Big Bang Theory, and this video is under supervision of Teacher Omnia and Teacher Isra. Let's get started. How did the universe originate? There was no one to relate what happened, but the discovered in physics and uh, uh, astronomy enable scientists to trace the history of the universe from the first second fraction of its evolution. Many scientists believe that the universe emerged from a massive explosion called Big Bang Theory. At 1933, assumed that the beginning of the universe was gas full of high pressure, high temperature, and small in volume. Then, a massive explosion occurs to this force since 15,000 million years, and its components were scattered in space followed by continuous expansion and changing process till now. Result from the, this explosion, all forms of matter, energy, space, and time. Through Big Bang, the gases ball from which the universe originated exploded and the process of expansion and changing started. Within minutes after the explosion, the temperature becomes about 10,000 million degrees and the atomic particles produced from the explosion merge together, producing gases clouds of hydrogen and helium with a percentage of 75% to 25% respectively. These gases produce the galaxies, stars, and universe through millions of years. After about 1,000 million years, the previously formed matter merged in the form of masses. After about 2,000 to 3,000 million years, gravity helped in gathering more masses from ancestral galaxies, leaving areas of empty space between them. After 3,000 million years, galaxies began to form. After 5,000 million years, Milky Way galaxies, which is our galaxies, took its disk form. After 10,000 10, million years, the sun was born and the earth and the planet were created. After 12,000 million years, earliest life from began to appear on the earth. After 15 million years, the universe is as it is. Now, now we will uh, say uh, to you our opinion about this theory. We will start it with Habib. Okay, in my opinion, this theory might be right or wrong. But as a normal human, I think it is impossible that everything around us comes from a gaseous pool. And this theory depends on that there is no good, but it is wrong. There is Allah who created us and created everything up around us. I agree, Habiba, in her opinion, but uh, I disagree uh, uh, with the scientists that we created from some gases because the human created by Allah and the animal created by Allah and everything created by Allah. So I think that impossible that everything created from some gases. Now we finished our talking about Big Bang Theory. We wish that you uh, understand this theory and have a good day. Goodbye. Goodbye.